question. <laughs> after you've done a show uh, and after the season, have you decided to bring a prop back? No, sadly, stupidly, I had no idea it was going to carry on. <laughs> you know, it's a job, and you know, I, I, I could shoot myself. I didn't take photographs. I, you know, I, could have, I, I should have been doing all that stuff. I, I should have had a wardrobe full of, you know, kind of things. Although I did end up by chance with the complete costume because I used to have to go and do public appearances and um, they gave me a spare costume to take on so that I could go it was dressed as the doctor. So I had those. Uh, I somehow ended up with three umbrellas. <laughs> and I think there were only three umbrellas in the world, so I had them up more. <laughs> anyway, I invented the umbrella. It was my idea, so I deserve to have it. As the owner of a double barrel name myself, I can sympathize with having a long name. Did you ever come to appreciate yours? <coughs> yes, no, I, I, I do like it now. And um, uh, the, the, the only curse about it is that uh, I can never remember anyone's name. And I, it's because I have too many of my own. <laughs> I'm sure that's why. I just I can't remember people's name. I even forgot my wife's name once. <laughs> but that's partly because of uh, I get nervous. I was brought up to be polite and introduce people, and I'm always doing it, knowing I have no idea who this person is. <laughs> you know, I, I've been working with them for five years. But who are you, Sir Ian Watts? Oh, yeah, well, you know, right? all that kind of stuff. So I, uh, um, I. Uh, uh, it is a bit of a curse, long names. Yes. Well, it was great when I got Sylvester McCoy because people, bankers, bank men would treat me with respect. Oh, oh yes, Mr. McCoy. And I, <laughs> <laughs> I'm Henry <really> McCoy. <laughs> you can pick any companion but your own. Who would you pick and why? You. <laughs> <laughs>